I came across the story quite some time ago, and the story was was uh, appealed to me. Um, uh, it just had a lot of elements in it, and um, it was quite a true. A lot of things that Robin, Malcolm, and myself play. It was quite a. Uh, well, you know, had that true element to it. It actually did happen a lot of the things. But um, yes, it was based on a story that um, happened back in two, 2016. It was a big, huge methamphetamine bust up north. A ship had come oh. down from Hong Kong. And that's a drama in itself, what took place on the ship and the actual journey down to New Zealand. That's a whole drama, which is in this Far North series as well. Robin and I make up only about a, you know, we're only in it every, we're about a third of the story. Then you've got all these young Polynesians coming up from Auckland and they were on a mission to get up there. And then all they had to do was go out, get a boat and get out there, get the stuff and then bring it back in again. But uh, there's a f series of errors that happened and things didn't quite go their way. And, um, and it all turned to custard after a while. So Robin and I play the, the locals yep. where um, they're the salt of the earth kind of people. He's a diesel mechanic. He's a fisherman. He can launch boats. He can fix tractors. He can even fix helicopters, this guy. And so um, Robin and I play these two people from Ahipara. It was great because we had them. We actually used their house. We used their dogs, and we became part of them, actually part of their community. We were filming in their house, and we're having them on set all day, and every day was also an added bonus for us too because we could use them as a reference. Well, I think again, it's, an, uh, the it's, North it's, North. it's also an added bonus for them too. I'm sure they'll be talking about this for years to come. There are, there are unlikely to be many people either here in Aotearoa or overseas who wouldn't mind sitting down and having a quiet one with one of our most iconic actors for a bit of a chin wag. What were some of the cool memories yes. from this experience for you? Well... The whole, the, the north was just uh, exceptional to work at. The 90 mile beach, some glorious mornings. You wake up to, to uh, some amazing sun, sunrises. The people, of course, a uh, number of times I'd open my door and, and, and there'd be a, a bucket of kinna, a bucket of uh, snapper, a uh, bucket of mussels. And uh, you wake up to these kinds of uh, community things where mm, people just mm. drop you off food and uh, these people are fishermen. And, and they're generous as well. So yeah. um, filming in New Zealand, it's also, I love filming here because of the camaraderie. <laughs> There's no egos. We're all on the same walker. Mm -hmm. uh, the director did a great job because he spent a long time researching this. He saw the story when it first broke and he actually thought there's something more to this. And he literally drove up from Auckland, found uh, these people uh, who Robin and Malcolm and I play he camped out with them, and he just wanted to know more and more about it, exactly what happened. So, And that's how it eventuated. He's done a great job at putting it all together. There's the Chinese element. There's uh, you know a lot of Mandarins being spoken with the subtitles in this. Mm. We've got the Polynesian element all coming up from Auckland. And then there's the local element, which Robin and I play. So it's a good old Kiwi yarn. So I believe you had some interns on the ship. What was that like, being able to help and support Rangatahi as a mentor? Well, I think I'm, I'm kind of getting into those mature years where it's great to give, give a little bit back now. Hmm. And, um, and, of course, we had a lot of the young people come on set with us and get a little insight into our industry. So that was good, too. And, um, again, it all started, you know, we, we do things right now. They pay respect to the locals. Uh, we have a, a big fucker toe to start the show off. And everyone comes together, so it was good. It was just one of those projects where... Everyone come together for the right reasons. Uh, they brought the love. There was no egos. And we're able to train people as well and get some of the locals involved. Lovely to have the chance to talk to you again. Iconic television and movie actor Tim Wetter Morrison. Thank you so much for joining us today, Ahoy, and I look forward to catching up again soon. Ngā mihi ki a koe. Ngā mihi hoki ki a koe. Me ngā iwi e mā takitaki mai nei nā. Ka nui te mihi mai yoha ki o koutou katoa. Kia ora mai tātou.